fudge. Who doesn't love fudge? Anyone love a freshly packed thing of fudge? Anyway, so imagine my dismay when about two years ago, I'm teaching class, right? I'm teaching class as I always do. I'm turned around at the board talking about half notes. Uh, and one of the boys, he raises his hand and he says, Miss Pym. That's what they call me, Miss Pym. He says, you have a, <clears throat> he says, you have camel toe. Camel toe, all right? I, I didn't know what that was. Y'all know what that is, camel toe? Yeah, well, I didn't. I said, hey, I don't wear open-toed sandals. What is camel toe? And this gal, this young gal, who's the, uh, sort of the darling of the class, she says, so she's very shy normally. She raises her hand. She says, Miss Pim, Miss Pim, uh, camel toe it means when you hike your pants up your vagina. And imagine my, I was aghast, right? But then I thought about it, and I thought, so what? So what, right? <laughs> So yeah, I do that, and um, I celebrate my curves, my smaller Woo! curves, my bigger curves, right, thank you. And exactly, and so I decided to start a movement called showyourtoe.org. Go, go look at it. I'll be at Jazz Fest selling, you know, raising awareness, selling a few garments that enhance and so forth. And, and, and man, I hear a lot of you in, in approval out there Celebrate your lady. Let her know it's okay. You know what I mean? It's, let her know it's all right. Thank you. Exactly. Right on. Rock on. So, um, so thank you. Off my soapbox I, soapbox, I told Rich in the band, I said, honey, if I come up here and I hear people commenting on it, on the lady, I'm going to have to do my thing. He said, do it, Miss Pim. We, you know, what's shaking, Miss Pim? Do it. So, do my, do my thing, Miss Pim. Right. Uh, so I, I try to stay relevant. So before we bring up the band, who, um, I'd like to, the, the new album out, the new uh, LP is called Keep the Beat. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and um, the, keeping the beat is very important in music, as you know. I'm passionate about it. And a lot of people say, Miss Pam, I can't do music. I'm no musician. And I say, Poppycock, you are too. You are a musician. And I'd like to illustrate that using you guys today. Just an old lesson I used to teach all these guys back in the, back in the day, as they say. Um, so I'd like you to divide yourselves up into four parts, okay? This is gonna be part one. Part two, let's make the bar part three. Bar, are you with me? Oh yes, howling wolves, great. And um, let's see, part four, um, maybe the people closest to, to the entrance if you're over there. All right, are you ready? This is a lot of audience participation. I'll tell you though, if a second through sixth grader can do it, y'all can do it. Okay, so this room, this part of the room, you're ready. You're going to do as follows, all right? When it, when it comes your turn, you're gonna be like this. Ta titi, 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 ta titi. Got it, so let's hear you do that. One, two, three. One, two, three, go! Ta titi, 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 ta titi. Oh, that's fabulous, fabulous! Oh my gosh, fantastic, fantastic! Now, good. Now remember your part. Ta titi, ta titi, ta titi, ta titi. You over here are just going to be keeping the beat really in a very quick quarter note way. Ready? It's going to be. Titty 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 you're gonna do a ta ta, ta ta, ta ta, ta ta. Got it? Ready and yes, yes. Exactly. Oh yeah, that's bringing it fiercely, bringing it very fiercely. Great. And now group four, wherever you are, who are you? Let me hear you. You out there? Okay, great. Group four is going to say. Titty ta ta, titty ta ta, titty ta ta, titty ta ta. Let's hear it. Yes. 
Yes. Tiri ta ta. Tiri ta ta. Fantastic. All right. Good. The time has come now to put it all together. You, you are all marvelous. If only the funding were back in the schools, I could be doing this. <clears throat> so just to review, let's hear you do it. Ta titi 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 ta ta great titty 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 ta titi ta titi titty 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 we need higher titties titty 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 ta titi ta titi titty 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 Ta 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 Good. Keep it going. Ta 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 very successful. I'm, I'm, I'm loving you, and I feel so special to be here. So relevant. If, if ever tonight you're feeling enthusiastic about something that's going on up here, don't feel, you know, feel free to just ta titty ta titty ta titty ta titty 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 ta 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 titty 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 whatever that one was over there. Great. Camel toe, camel toe, camel toe, camel toe, camel toe. Great, great, show your toe, good. Now I have my sheet out, my cheat sheet, because of course I've taught these kids so long ago at different times, but one thing I don't remember is what they wound up settling on as their instrument. We went through tuba, saxophone, trumpet, keyboards, you know. Uh, so finally, now they've settled on some things. We're gonna bring them up right now one at a time, and I'd like to just kind of add an anecdote about them that I have, uh, memory, memory lane. First person I'd like to bring out is George Brown on the drums, folks. George Brown on the drums. Titty, 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 George Brown. Come up, George. Oh my gosh, isn't he a doll? You know, something about George uh, Brown, before he was a big fancy drummer like he is now, he used to come in, he used to give me his fruit roll up every day. He would bring out the fruit roll up the first time I said, well, how do I even eat this thing, right? He said, look, it just says right here, Miss Pam, unroll peel, and eat. I thought, you know, look who's teaching the teacher. George Brown, everybody, give him a hand. A great lover of fruit roll-ups. No, George. And he keeps the beat, let me tell you. Um, next up we have D.C. Harbold. D.C. Harbold on lead guitar and vocals. D.C., come on up here, cutie pie. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh I missed you. Oh, wow. oh it's good to see Look at that kid, how he's grown up. We used to, at recess, he used to come in, we played Sorry, we played Connect Four, we played, what else did we play? Zip, the Zip Zip Game. Yes, he and I played Zip Zip Game. I'll teach you that next show. Uh, till, till, uh, till, read, till the bell rang. Uh, next up we have Weston Ganeshow. Yay, Weston, he's one of the younger ones. He's on bass and vocals. And he, I'll uh, tell you what, come up here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Look at him. He's growing his hair long. I, I, I said, keep it above the ears. But he said, no, Miss Pim. This is how they're wearing it. So, uh, funny story about him. When he was coming to my class, Nirvana was just happening. You familiar with the band Nirvana? He said, this, this is called Smells Like Teen Spirit. And he actually, Weston actually helped me pen my first erotic note to Dave Grohl. And there were many more to follow. Um, I was actually just contacted by Dave Grohl's people, hmm, his people, asking me to stop writing the letters. Uh, but I think that they made an impression, so that's good. Uh, so that's, uh, that's Weston. And next up, Rich Siegel. You know Rich. He's on guitar and vocals. He writes a ton of the songs, too. Where are you, Rich? Oh. guy came to my class one day with his eyebrows shaved completely off. No eyebrows, you believe it. I had to take out my Maybelline and pencil in his brows for the day, but he's, he, he was into the glam rock, so he thought, oh, I'm Ziggy Stardust. He's a, he's a, he's a cutie. And finally, 
Now this is this is exciting for me because I feel like you know I back way you know we we went through so many Sears catalogs together, looking at fashion, looking at things to to wear, and she would say this the, the lovely gal would say, Miss Pim, when can I be a grown woman like you? Wear cute clothes like you. You know, and we always, I always said, you'll, you'll get there, you'll get there, and she's gotten there. And little does she know, I was actually on her first date that she would ever, uh, that she ever went on. I don't think she knows that. I was hiding in the back seat. We saw little darlings at the, uh, the drive-through theater. Kristen McNichol, who is a little darling. Anyway, without further ado, kids, let's bring out your smoking hot lead singer tonight. Have a good time, Miss Barbara Menendez. Good night. The help, ladies and gentlemen, the help. Titi-ta-ta. -ta. 